Hi, welcome to a quick introduction on how to sell things on my marketplace. First thing we want to do is go into marketplace, go to my marketplace and create a store. Accept the terms and conditions and that will create you a new store. Your store has been created. You need to restart the viewer to begin listing products. So the first thing I want to do is come out of Second Life. Let's go back to Marketplace while well, that's happening. And we can do our store setup. So we can edit the store information and we can call it something, we can add some profile information, policies, if you have a blog you can put in the link to that, if you have an in-world store you can put in the slurl. Two things that I would suggest you do, there's a store image here and a store banner image. Now the store image is just like a little logo and it says the image must be exactly 45 pixels by 45 pixels. So let's create one of those. So we'll go into Paint Shop Pro and we go file new you can use paint or any package like that 45 pixels by 45 pixels I'll keep the background black and say OK and there is your store picture now it's not very big all I'm going to get in there is about one or two characters or a very tiny logo I'm just going to stick in a character so I'll say just an N for that and drag that into place and I will save that as store logo and I will call that that because it will do me but one of the things to remember is that this file type should be JPEG so that's store logo JPEG and save the next one we're going to want is a new file which is 700 wide by 100 high again just leave that black because that'll do me I'll put some text in there make it about 36 pixels high and go Nacti store there we go that'll do us for a store banner so file save as banner and make sure it's JPEG again so that, that file type there is JPEG and that's the main items that we want to do that so we'll go back to marketplace and we can now choose the file for the store image and that would be the store logo open that choose the file for the banner and open that and then simply save that and after marketplace has done its thing you should see the banner and all the rest of it there okay so we'll now go into manager listings and this is where you actually start to sell and list your stock and we'll go in there and you see there's nothing listed now the reason for that is you need to create it and upload it from Second Life so I shall pause the video and we'll go into Second Life Viewer so inside Second Life Viewer let's create something we we'll use the build menu and uh, we'll just build a simple prim, res it over there and the key thing here is to name this thing and set the next owner rights to modify, copy and transfer or not as suits you. That's basically all you need to do to make something saleable. I've kept it simple I'm going to take that object because that puts it in my inventory. Go to Recent, go to Objects, there's the Prim, right click on it and you'll see down the bottom here Copy to Merchant Outbox. So to get that all we did was right click on the Prim. That has created a new folder for me, we say OK. It's gone into the background 
click on it again or drag it over to one side and that thing should now be going up to the marketplace by clicking send to marketplace so we open the folder click on the object and then use send to marketplace get a little delay well second life sorts its files out and that should then turn up on the marketplace all folders were success successfully sent to the marketplace okay so we can put that away now I'm going to drag it back out to the ground because we're going to need a snapshot of it so I'll just quickly zoom in on it there is our magic prim that does nothing but it's just the simplest object I could think to create we'll take a snapshot save to my computer save as and I want to go to desktop all snapshots and this is a snapshot of a prim or whatever you want to call that so go back to marketplace and now you can in the manage listings box you can look for unlisted items and now your stock starts to appear and there is my prim and the first action we want to do over on the right here is to create a new listing so after a bit of a delay with second life up it comes SKU is a stock code kind of thing I'll call it 001 it's version 1 the item status I want it to be active the maturity level I don't care so general it's not mesh and then the permissions is important so we'll go copy mod transfer uses requirements nothing much there I want you can put in the product features and an extended description and I'm telling people don't buy it it's important to put in your category so I will browse for a category and I'll put it under avatar accessories as oh my goodness a mask the item price I'll make it one linden prim count one I don't have an SL URL where you can buy it I don't have a video about it I may add this video later the available quantity unlimited upload an image now and you can see here that it needs to be 512 by 512 or 700 by 525 so let's go back into paint shop find that image open the file snapshot of the prim resize it image resize 512 by 512 which will squish it up a wee bit but I don't care you can faff around with the items when you're doing them properly and then save that as the snapshot of the prim at 512 and I'm going to change that to a JPEG just simply so I keep working in JPEGs all the time save that back to marketplace now click here to select the image snapshot of the prim at 512 open and then after a bit of a delay it goes back and you can see the images now come in as part of my edited details you could also add an animated gif and a portable document file if you wanted to describe more about that thing there are no related items no demo items if you select these listing enhancements to feature it on the home page and go add you will see that there's a charge uh, nearly 3000 lindens for 30 days so I'm going to skip that there's no extra distribution for this now I want to double check that I've got this item status active and I have also got it categorized so I've got the category here these are the two key things you need to make sure are set and just simply press update
and now my prim you can see is active. If you wish you can go look at the preview and you'll see how it would appear in your store. Now that's about all I wanted to say but um, if you want to find that object the easiest way is to go merchant stores and then key in your name and search and if you do this from another avatar you can do a test purchase on it there's my name there's my item click on it and you can see there that you can then buy that item so we created a picture of our prim we created a banner for our store and a logo for our store and that ladies and gentlemen was how to sell on SL Marketplace.